welcome back to the channel. Today we have a very special guest. We have Jamie Jacob, professional golfer. We are at Rancho Santa Fe Golf Club and we played today mm -hmm. and I kind of struggled with my chipping, especially the flop shot. So fun one. Yeah, you gotta take that big swing. You know, I'm more about the bump and run. <laughs> so, Which is a very consistent shot. Yeah, but exactly. But sometimes you gotta go over a bunker, gotta go yeah. over water. So today, Jamie is going to give me and you some of her tips and tricks to a flop shot. My little baby hairs are like, I know. <laughs> I'm just gonna show you how I normally hit a flop shot. Yeah, it's a lot of trial and error in a sense. Mm -hmm. uh, and the miss is quite big usually. It, like the way I'm doing it, yeah. I usually skull it or yeah. chunk it a little bit. So I just like don't even know where it is. Right. So sometimes I just don't use it. But what I do is I normally feel like I'm aiming left and then opening the club base mm -hmm. at the target. And then I kind of have this cast motion like that. Yeah. And I feel it cast and then I come forward. I mean, that was pretty nice. Oh, that kind of worked. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, that kind of worked. Of course, um, in front of the camera. The problem she gets is that it's kind of inconsistent. Mm -hmm. That was a good one, but I normally don't have enough confidence to use it on the course. So that one is probably a little thicker. Yeah. Something closer to what it would be like on okay. the course. So yeah. I'm like, in that case, I might as well just kind of do like a bump and run yeah. again closer right. to the pin, oh, yeah. You know? yeah. So yeah, it'd be really nice to kind of learn your tips on how to have a more consistent yeah. long shot. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. So I'd say the inconsistency part is definitely in the hand. Okay, you have the flop shot and then you have like the mega flop shot. Mm -hmm. So for the normal flop shot, which is pretty much the one I always use, I'm only using the mega flop if I'm, you know, if I have the six, much to go. Yeah, yeah. you like, you really don't have much room. You need to get it high and you need it to stop. And I, I also rarely use that on the course because yeah. it's it's just not very consistent. So the normal flop shot that I do is same thing. You like you aim your feet left and then you lay the face wide open, but you would lay the face open and then set your feet uh -huh. open according to that. You're going to set up like shaft kind of in the middle of your stance. Ball is going to be forward according to your foot line. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, but not much though. Like I like to have it pretty center and then I keep my hands really still. So I think that's where your, the inconsistency okay. comes from. Because it's really hard to time your hands when you're releasing it through like that. Yeah. And it's like kind of a scooping motion. And that would be more the mega flop. That's mm -hmm. why I think the mega flop's more inconsistent. Got it. So I pretty much just leave it here, bring it up to the top like a normal golf swing, always swinging along my foot line. Mm -hmm. And then my favorite tip is just like once you get up here, feel your right shoulder just relax underneath. Oh. And you're pretty much just letting the club head get okay. under the ball. So you're not going to force the speed, like, once you get comfortable with it, you could now, but like, as other people get more comfortable with speed and swinging hard on a short sh short yeah. shot, it feels really uncomfortable. Um, that's when you can speed it up more, but in the beginning, just let the club head, like, get underneath the ball. Don't, like, really try yeah, it. Because the faster you swing, the more thin it'll be. Yeah. Right. So basically, you would say the two tips are swing on your foot line mm -hmm. and take a regular swing. Yeah. Um, and basically it's all in your setup. Yeah. It's so much setup. So it's all set up and you can take a regular swing and yeah. you should get a proper flop shot. Yeah. Ooh, that's nice. So then land so soft. Yeah, I mean I have new wedges. Yeah. <laughs> These are fresh. <laughs> new grooves. New grooves. Um and then the mega flop, like you can definitely get it higher. I'm gonna try it. I, I mean it's more fun to just play with. Yeah. But um, I'll let my hands release a little more in this one. Get it a little higher. All right, so to recap, Jamie. Yes. It all starts with the setup. Yes. Mostly in the setup, mm -hmm. we're gonna put our face all the way flat against the ground, and we're going to aim left. We're going to take a regular sleep, no casting for a regular flop. And we're gonna swing on our foot line. And then let your right shoulder relax. Oh, head. yeah, okay. Feel the right shoulder relax down. Okay. Let's see how I do. Yeah. Oh, I did it! Really good. 
really good. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's go. Look at that. Coach. That was great. <laughs> okay, let's see it again. Okay, wow. That was very, it just like slid right under. Yeah. yeah. Great. It's that right shoulder thing. Right shoulder. Telling you. That's what it's it like is. using the bounce and matching it to the line. Really good. Okay, yeah, I did it stop. again. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. I didn't hit it that good either. Oh, now do one and just like commit to it. Commit to it. Okay. Full commitment. A little more speed, but don't force the speed. Just okay. like know where it's going. Um. So commit as in just feel like it's yes. going to go in the hole. Right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wow, really good. Ooh. Wow. Nice. nice. All right. She's a Let's flopping go. machine. Flop yeah. <laughs> Love it. And that, folks, is how you hit a flop shot. <laughs> All right, folks, that's a wrap. Thank you so much awesome. to Jamie for helping me with my flop shot. I'm going to be using it a lot more on the course. Heck yeah. Yeah, right now I just kind of can't pray. But <laughs> with practice, I really think that we can start to put that shot in my head. A little bit of practice, a little bit of trust. Yeah. Uh, yeah, of course. <laughs> Don't forget to follow Jamie. We're going to link it right over here. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss a video. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye, guys. We're going to be late. I get the wine and the corkscrew. You don't have to Today's do video. one single thing. You don't know how much I want you. <laughs> Just looking at you makes my whole world